Hi guys, I'm Mila for Basically Burgundy and I'm doing another haul because I shop as one does. Sorry if I look like a hot mess, it's because I am one. But I only have like an hour or so and I really wanted to film this video before I leave town. So here we go. Now I have a few other clothing items and some beauty stuff. But the main thing that I'm super excited for and why I'm filming today and I can film earlier is because I just got this in the mail. So it's a package from ASOS and this is my first time ever shopping with ASOS. So I'm really, really excited to try their stuff. Um, I love Boohoo stuff when I ordered from them, but they don't ship to Serbia. So it's like, I really love your stuff, but I can't get it. But ASOS does, and about the process itself, it was, um, the package took a bit longer than they said. They said that it would be here by the 14th, and today is the 20th, and I just got it. But when it didn't come on the 14th, I contacted them, and they just said, just be a bit patient, there's maybe something going on with, you know, post-Serbia, so, you know, just wait a few more days, and then if it doesn't come for another, like, 10 days, then contact us again. Uh, so I waited, and it came, and I haven't opened it yet, but I'm really excited. Also, the as far as taxes and stuff goes, Serbia usually charges 40%, like 20% on taxes and 20% on customs. But actually, I did not pay that much. I think the total for this package was 47 British pounds, and I paid an additional around like 10 pounds. Okay, so I have a pair of scissors, and let's open this. I'm always scared when opening packages like this that I'm just gonna cut through whatever is inside of it. <sighs> Better if we tear it. Okay, so the first thing that I got was two skirts. This is, they're the same, just in different colors. <clears throat> and this one, it's in the size 18 and it's in the color blush. Now you guys know that I love skater skirts, so wearing them I love, I just love everything about skater skirts, they're just the best thing in the world. Um, and I'm starting university soon and I just, you know, I just needed some everyday clothes because I did a huge wardrobe declutter, I'm going to have a whole separate video for that, but I just needed some new things. So I got some basic skater skirts. So this is from ASOS's own brand, it looks like this. It's a very very nice color, and it doesn't it doesn't like have a zipper on it or anything. It's just you know like uh, stretchy. And actually, looking at it now, I think that this is probably going to be too big. But you know the good thing about skater skirts, if they're too big and if you don't want to send them back, you can just sort of in the back where the seam is just take them in a bit more. And then we're all good, but I don't know, we're going to have to see when I try it on. Okay, so this is the first uh, blush skirt, and as I thought it's too big for my waist, it has like a lot of space, uh, but then if I put it sort of more down on my hips, then it's not that flattering, and the cup's too long, and it's just not, you know, how a skater skirt should be. So I think basically what I'm going to do is just, you know, wear it up, and then just sort of take it in at the back, and then it's going to be... Okay, okay, so the second thing from ASOS is again the same skater skirt, but this time in white and I've had two white skater skirts before and I've never worn them um, And I actually just gave them away in this declutter um, So I a part of me is like why did I get this? I don't wear it but I decided that I'm going to try myself, so it's the same thing, and I didn't mention both of them are in like a texture, they're a ribbed uh, fabric. Uh, it just, you know, goes horizontal, and yeah, this one, same size, just in white. Again, it's probably going to be too big, but uh, we'll see when I put it on, because I really like my skater skirts to sort of sit on my waist, and this looks more like it's gonna be on the hips, so we'll see how it fits. Okay, so with the white one, it's exactly the same story. It's too big for my waist, it's sort of falling down, so I'm just going to, again, take it in, take it in at the back. But I really, I really like it. I like it, even though this one's white, because it's a ripped textured material, it's not see-through. So I'm, I'm really liking this one. 
Okay, so the next thing, and I'm really excited about this, but now I'm getting sort of scared that I may have ordered, like, sizes too big. Uh, the thing that I do is, uh, I usually order a size UK uh, 18, so that my boobs would fit, because generally I, my boobs are two sizes larger than the rest of my body, so it's really hard to shop online when you can't try things. So I just sort of stuck with, you know, like a size 18 because I know that fits my boobs. And in ASOS you can get that size in like the regular size range and in the plus size range. So some of these are plus, some of these are regular. Like these two skirts and this dress that I'm about to open are all from regular. And I got them all in size 18. But I don't know if they're maybe too big when I try it on. I will tell you whether or not you should size down if for something like that. For skirts, I probably should have sized out because they have nothing to do with my boobs. I don't really know why I got them in size 18. But, let's see. Okay, so this next dress. Okay, this is just in a large and it's from Brave Soul. A little dress with long sleeves. And it's not exactly, it's like a semi skater. I'm not sure. You'll see what it looks like on. This one actually looks like it's going to fit really well. It's in size large. And it's just black, plain black, like a, uh, you know, jersey. Is this jersey? I don't, I'm not sure. I, it should be like a thin jersey. Now, one thing I do notice is, I don't know if you can see that, but that's really see-through. So, um, I'm probably going to have to wear something underneath it, or so I'll, we'll see when I try it on. Okay, so this is the dress, and honestly, I'm a bit disappointed, it doesn't fit my boobs, um, you know, I, I really love how everything else fits and everything else fits great, but then this sort of part that cinches in, that's supposed to be at the waist, it's sitting like midway down my boobs and it's just making me look like a barrel and it's not fluttering at all, so I'm, ah, oh, I'm so sad about it, this is the problem with dresses that are not made for people with big boobs. But you can't know that when you are done online. So I'm probably just gonna give this dress to my mother. Her belts are the same, but she had a bit smaller chest. So, you know, that's that's what's gonna happen with this one. And the last thing, and the thing that I'm most excited about, uh, I'm, oh my God, I'm so excited for this. I got, for the first time in my life, a bomber jacket. Now, I know that Bomber jackets are all the rage now and everyone is wearing them and everyone has one. I've never had a bomber jacket and I really love the style of them, but I have no idea how they're actually going to fit or how it's going to fit on me. So we're about to try that right now. So this is what it looks like. It's in a green and white sort of zigzag pattern and then it has uh, a different material. Uh, sleeves and uh, it's actually it's very very light I thought it would be a bit thicker actually but it's just it's super light which actually kind of makes it perfect for the sweater that we're having so I might be actually happy that I can wear it now and then for winter I'm probably just gonna get a coat anyway so yeah this is getting a size 18 by live in love um, and this is from the plus size range and this yeah this is the only one so I really hope that it fits well Okay, so in case any of you were wondering, these jeans are from Boohoo and this shirt is from Tom Taylor. But this bomber, I'm, I'm actually kind of digging it. Uh, and I could have gone with a size smaller. The This is a size 18, I probably should have gotten like a 16. Um, the sleeves are a bit too long and a bit too wide, so I might just, you know, take them in a bit just to make them a bit, uh, you know, tighter. And generally the jacket, you know, it's... Uh, let me zip it up so you can see. Um, I I like it. I like the gold detail of the zipper. I like generally the sort of really really casual feel it gives an outfit. Uh, one thing that it's still completely missing is pockets. There are no pockets on it. Where are my pockets? Um, I generally I do like jackets when they have pockets. But this is uh, this is probably the reason why I didn't. I buy a huge amount of clothes at once because it's my first time shopping with ASOS. I just got like these four things, they were all like pretty cheap. Um, just to see sort of how the sizing works, things like that. Uh, and I think that for all of, like for my next 
shopping uh, adventures, I'm going to have to size down on everything by quite a bit. Moving on, I have two more clothing items and they're both tops, like little blouses from H&M. Uh, I bought these in store and I've already worn both of them. So this is the first one. I really, really loved the, the pattern on it. And what I love is, uh, this is one of the very, very few uh, items that actually is like a button up and it actually fits my boobs without creating the, you know, the little gap in between the buttons. So I'm really in love with it. It fits amazingly. Again, I've already worn both of them so I know how they fit. They're awesome. Yeah, it's just, I mean, it's polyester but it actually feels like quite nice and it's a really, it's really light and, you know, just a nice sort of light breathable shirt. Um, I'll see if uh, all the things from ASOS I will link below and then if I can find this on the H&M website I will link it also below. But yeah, I'm really in love with this shirt. I think it's so great for like, also for layering, but just to wear on a warmer day. Okay, and the second thing from H&M, actually both of these I bought because I got a sort of a corporate job, so I had to dress all smart. Um, but I got this, this second one, I can show you. It's again a blouse. Um, it has a sort of a mock turtleneck and it has a little keyhole detail in the back, you can see there. And it's just a long sleeve and then white with black polka dots all the way. It has like slits. Oh, here they are. It has slits on both sides. And again, it fits very nicely. This one actually has some stretch in it. So if you're scared that something like, I don't know, that sometimes shirts like this can be tight around the arms or around wherever like you carry some weight so if you get this uh, it has like quite a bit of stretch in it well not quite a bit but it has a bit of stretch so it's it's really comfortable and it's really flattering I really like it it's sort of longer the first one from H&M that I showed it you know sort of like normal length this one comes a bit longer uh, so that you can wear it maybe even with you know some leggings that's a bit iffy, but you know, if you have some like pants that aren't that flattering like on over your stomach or the crotch area, then it'll sort of cover that up. Okay, that was all the clothes. Now I have a few beauty items. I'll just rush through them. Um, the first one has a very sad story. So I've been looking for a good glass nail file for the longest time. I, I, I couldn't find a good glass nail file. I was just like, where do I find you? Um, but I found this one and it's by Elite Models and it's just a little, you know, black to white gradient. And then I got it and um, I was so excited for it because I finally found it and I was showing it to my boyfriend on Skype uh, before I went to sleep. And I, uh, I went to sleep and in the morning I woke up and realized that I slept on it and that it snapped in half. So now I have two glass nail files, or two halves of one glass nail file. I'm, I was so sad. It was, oh my God. But um, I wasn't, it was, I think around like $5. So I might just get another one. But I mean, it still works. It's just, it just snapped in half. So I, I was so sad about that. But also as I was getting that, I got this, Really, really cool holographic nail polish from Miss Porty, and it's called Metal Flip. That's weird, but yeah, it's called Metal Flip, and it's a really nice hollow nail polish. So uh, I, I like it also on my nails. It's quite sheer though, so you should kind of be careful with that. Okay, I have two more things to show you, and the first one is this wallet. Now, this one I didn't actually buy or get or anything. I found it sitting in a box in my house because you know every house has that box with like gifts that are like last minute that you can like re-gift to people and stuff like that so I was going through it because I needed a last minute gift and I found this and I was like mom why the hell don't I know that we have this and it's so pretty it's by a brand that I can't pronounce so I'll just write it here and I think it's a Macedonian brand um and basically it's just a little like clutch wallet you can see here I'll show you a close-up. It has, you know, a space for cards and for some change and then for just cash and then some more cards. Uh, and actually the reason why I really love it is because of the next thing and the last thing this haul that I'm gonna show you. 
And that thing is my phone. Uh, I got a new phone and it's actually a phablet, which is like phone and a tablet, so it's really, really big. Uh, but it can actually fit, no problem, in this clutch wallet thing, so that's why I really like this one. But uh, my phone is from me and it's a Redmi 3 Pro. I really love it, it has a little fingerprint ID and yeah, it needs to be connected to the charger, but this is what it looks like, I'm really loving it. It has an Android, it's... It's just really good. I am really in love with this phone. I absolutely recommend it. And you can get it for really cheap. It takes a long time uh, to ship to Europe because it's coming from China. But I I don't care. It's it's really good. I messed up when I was putting the sort of tempered glass on top. I have a few like air bubbles and stuff. But that's fine. That's fine. Life goes on. Um, so yeah, I'm really loving this phone. Uh, and that's sort of been a really big purchase recently. So yeah, those were all the things for this haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please, if you have any comments or questions or suggestions, just leave them down below and I'll make sure I read them. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe down there for more because I'm going to be uploading quite a bit more because I'm moving to my own apartment so I'm going to have, you know, always the space and the time and the quiet that's so rare when you live in a house with five people. So, yeah, thank you again so, so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!